Hello, I'm Sam Samslot, and welcome back to Kerbal Space Program. And, uh, last time we were in, we had some close calls to success. Definitely had some favors, fa failures. Um, came back, did some changes, uh, mostly just paint job. Uh, I added, um, a fuel line right here. Right, right there, because apparently this was a fuel tank. And not just for, you know making stuff fit and I also added uh, I added the fuel line so fuel would actually go into the this which would make it last a teeny bit longer which will be nice perfect delightful um, I also added the coupler after that so I could actually dispose of it afterwards which is sweet um, uh, yeah I think that's I think that's everything um, you know what? I actually, I want to add some more lights. So, let's zoom in here, and we will add lights right there. Is it stark in space? And if you can't see what you're doing. It's hard to work. Okay, so we will now save this and launch. Sweet, sweet launch. Speaking of launch, I need to have some lunch soon, maybe if if I'm a good boy. Mm, probably not. I'm I'm probably gonna try to figure out how to do ray tracing in Minecraft after this. All right, first things first, a throttle, actually. There's the moon. I want to be in line with the moon. So throttle up. I'm feeling also that the uh, the color job that I changed now the orange will be uh, easier to see instead of the white and black with that it was before. Um, no. Eh, close enough. Okay, now hopefully we can do this perfectly without problems. Okay, we're in space now, so I think we're just going to go straight to the apoapsis and, and then you know, do our sideburn. Okay. Now we...
Okay. I'm hoping that this goes well. As always. Duh. But burning before the apoapsis is way better than trying to do it afterwards. Because if you do it afterwards, you're playing like hard, hard catch up. Ready on the control? But that's the button to drop the throttle. Now they're going to spin. I think I just made... Oh, I just made the perfect orbit. The perfect orbit. Nearly perfect. It would have been perfect if I did a 180 with the Apoapsis and Periapsis. But... Oh, so good. So good. <sighs> oh... I've never done that before. Ever. Now, I can get rid of this if I want to. Of course, there was, uh, there's definitely a way. I just don't know what it is to make myself go around my current orbit perfectly, but faster. Because I would love to be, like, zipping around the planet. I've, I have almost like half the fuel tank left. Okay, I'm just going to get rid of it bef instead of like... Because I'm going to screw something up if I... If I, uh... Fiddle. Oh, that's such a beautiful separation. Oh, it's so cool, so cool. Okay. Uh, let's rotate. So we're facing outward. Um, toggle the lights. Look at that. Perfectly lit. Uh, log observate. Infrared telescope can't be done right now. Why not? Uh, the Sentinel infrared telescope needs to be activated on a solar orbit. Okay, so problem. That would be orbiting the sun. But now that I know that, uh, next time, orbiting the sun's easy. Just fucking leave Kerbin as hard and as fast as you can, and boom, you're orbiting the sun. Um. Extend that, extend that, extend that. Wish there was a button just to like do all of these things real fast. You don't need this many antennas, but it's nice to be, you know perfect. Um let's open that. Beautiful. Look how awesome that looks. Now, only if I could actually fly a spaceship properly and actually dock it. Now, that'd be something to see. Ugh. I'm so proud of myself. I got myself into space, into orbit. Perfectly in orbit, might I add. I am proud. I wish I could leave this episode here, but I can't because... No, it's, that would just be wrong. Am I still picking up speed, or am I slowing down? No, I'm, I'm slowing down. Um... Okay. Well, 
There's no way in heck that I'm uh, I'm falling back to back to Kerbin, which is nice. Look at that bright boy. Wow. Oh man, that is that is something. Getting into space now. Now the fun part would definitely. It's not gonna be fun. It's gonna be hell. If I if I tried to orbit again with another object, trying to dock with this. Oh, it's good. that is gonna be so hard, so hard. But it needs to be. It needs to be done. I also need to work up my courage to do it. Cause I'm pretty sure if you if you mess it up, you can blow up the whole thing. What I also need to do. Wait. Oh, you know what I should have done. Uh, well, first, let's get out of map view and let's do that. Um, what I should have done is I should have extended this bit further out. My that way. Um, but I'm, what I'm getting at is I I wanted to be able to bring this crew back. They are not coming back ever at this point because they're in orbit and I do not have a way to get them out as of right now um so poor jebediah kerman and bill kerman and bob kerman the brothers uh they will be stuck in space forever doing science maybe uh they will never run out of energy though that, that that's a thing solar it's perfect um i wish i could have detached this too it's kind of just bulky and weird. Anywho, well, that's that. Um, I guess in the next episode, if I remember to play Kerbal Space Program soon, which I, I might do to the success being so boldening, um, I'll, I'll do my best. I'll use the same spaceship. Like, the only thing I'll change is this part here. Um, and I'll just make it spacey like maybe i'll do a whole like crew exchange not really crew exchange but i'll be like okay come on come back home somehow like uh maybe i'll do like a docking sandwich where it'll be like um i'll leave behind like a crewless thing that will just be robotic and then like that will be docked and disattached from the returning vessel so that it can now control this thing i don't know if that'll actually work or not and then i'll have the crew transfer to a, a cabin of sorts and then come back home don't know if that would work i have to do some research before i attempt anything crazies like that <sighs> but like i was saying that's all the time I have for this episode. I'm Sam Sams a lot. Like, comment, subscribe, ring that bell to get notified every time I upload a video, and I'll catch you on the flip side. Bye!